first, I just want to say thank you for 400 subscribers. I went on my channel the other day to like see the last video I posted. And I like saw that we hit 400 and I was like, wait, what? Like I thought we just hit 300 and like, yeah, thank you so much. Hey, new people. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, today's video is going to be a back to school haul, mainly like clothing stuff. Um, but there's a few school supply things in the mix. And I'm really excited to show y'all what I got. I'm going to do a quick little disclaimer really quick. There is kind of like a lot of stuff. Like this is the biggest haul I've done. But it's because the stores we went to, like, the deals were crazy. Like, my mom is, like, one of those people that, like, is just really good with sales. And we found so much stuff on sale. And it was, like, buy one, get one free at PacSun. And their sale section, I literally got jeans for $5. It was freaking crazy. So, yeah, without further ado, I'm just gonna show y'all what I got. I'm gonna start with PacSun because... It was the place where the deals just really were good. Um, oh, I did get these jeans that I'm wearing. They're just like black mom jeans that are like kind of cropped. Like, you know, they like stop right, right there. Yeah. These were literally $2.95. $2.95. Like, that's insane for Paxson. You know, like most of their jeans are literally 60 freaking dollars. And for some reason right now, they literally have the best sales in the entire world. So I'm telling you to go freaking look at this place because I also got this pair of jeans. They're boyfriend jeans because I don't have a boyfriend. And so this is the only type of boyfriend thing that I am close to having. Um... Yeah, they were just like ripped jeans. But what I like about them is that the only holes that are actually real are like the small ones at the top. And then the ones on your knees actually like have denim behind them. So since this is back to school, it makes it good for like dress code and stuff. Oh, ready for the price? $5.97. So I don't know if everyone is a fan of overalls, but I sure am. They're super comfortable. And so I got these black overalls that were priced at $3. Do you, know, do you want to know what the original price is? I can't find the tag. Um, let's try and find that somewhere, please. That would be nice. Okay, here. These are originally $70. Actually, I got them for $2 because they were buy one get one free with another pair of overalls in denim. Look at all the overalls. It's a freaking... I'm gonna look like a true Texan at school this year wearing all of my overalls. Okay, mixing it up from jeans because I feel like I'm showing y'all so much denim right now. It's kind of crazy. Um, I got this skirt that's white and it's like two-toned, so it's like flattering on, on, on the body, you know? It, it looks good. My hair is doing great. This was $9.99, so it's like a little bit more, but like still $9.99. Like I'm pretty sure jeans at like Goodwill are $9.99, so I'm fine. Um, oh, okay, and then I got these. These were $2. I can't wear these to school because they are really ripped, but I got them because they're really, really comfortable. And then, um, these were the only full price jeans that I bought, but um, they were buy one, get one free. And so technically they were still only like 25. Two more pairs of jeans. Okay, we're almost done with jeans. This is so obnoxious. I got um, this striped pair. They're mom jeans with like, stripes on them. I got these um, John Gall brand that are like in a dark blue. And these are just like plain blue. There's no holes or anything, which is good. 
That was the last of the denim from Paxa. Now I'm gonna go into the top. That was actually also on sale. Most of it, I think the entire store was buy one get one free. And then the stuff that was like John Gall or Brandy Melville was buy one get one 50% off, which is still a really good deal for those brands because they literally never go on sale. I, I got this shirt that says Beijing and that's cute. These shirts were buy one 50% off or free. I can't remember. I don't know. I'm sorry. But they're just these comfy long sleeve shirts and like that graph, like really comfy soft material. So I got it in red and also a yellow one. And then I recently I picked up the sport tennis. Not that good yet. Woot woot. Yeah, I just started taking tennis lessons for fun. And I saw this hoodie and it was like buy one get one 50% off too. And it says Versailles Racket Club. And it has well, it's like tennis club, but like, you know, like European looking. Oh, these were in the sales section. They were three dollars and I'm not gonna wear these to school, obviously, but they're just like really comfy pajama pants. Oh, um, I also got this pair of pants from PacSun and I'm very obsessed with them. They're so cute. They kind of uh, look like a pair of pants that my grandpa has. I don't know, they're different from wearing jeans every single day. That, that was kind of like a point. I made this to you. I also got this dress that was um, in the sales section and I can't wear this by itself at school, but I have a denim jacket or some other jacket I have that I think is really cute for like whenever I'm trying to try harder than normal. Oh, and then this shirt was also, it was free with the shirt I just showed. And it's really cute. It's just like a white kind of quarter sleeve. Okay, we're done with Paxson. And now I'm going to move on to something else because I feel like that's a lot of clothes. This is my baby. This is my literal baby. Like, I am so happy. Oh my god. <gasps> okay, so I got the Falavin Rakonkin. Falavin Konkin. Falavin. Falavin Konkin. Falavin Konkin. Falavin. Falavin Konkin. Falavin. Falavin. You may have seen them. I don't know, but I've been seeing these on like everyone's, like they're on Instagram, they're on YouTubers' accounts and stuff, but they're the, you know, Fahalvin Robin Konkin, and I love them so much! Mine is from Urban Outfitters. It's just so cute. It's my baby. Ah. I'm gonna show y'all my school supplies. Oh yeah, I feel like I should say what grade I'm going into. I'm going into 10th grade. I'm a sophomore in high school. Um, yeah, that's about it. So this year, whenever I went in for school supplies, it wasn't like I was trying to like do the whole like <laughs> kindergarten versus senior year thing. I wasn't trying to do that. Like I literally wasn't even thinking about that. But whenever I was looking at the supplies, I was like, I don't really need anything besides paper and pencils. Like you literally don't at this point. Like there's nothing you really need. So I got a folder for my homework and then the only paper I'm bringing is a five subject spiral and that's the amount of classes I have that you actually need something for. But I got some of these erasers that are really good um, and also 36 colored pencils from Hobby Lobby because everyone always asks to use my markers and colored pencils. Oh, I'll show y'all the shoes I got. Um, I got a pair of black Converse because um, I got some in seventh grade and I'm literally still the same size of shoe I was in seventh grade, okay? I got these freaking shoes in seventh grade and like they disappeared. Like I don't know where they, they disappeared. I have no idea where they went. Like if like 
I took them to a friend's house and forgot them, but how do you, how do you forget your shoes? I, I don't know, but um, I got another pair of black Converse after a long waited two years of losing them. I don't know, I like black Converse more than white Converse because I feel like everyone has white Converse and I'm just like really different. I, I go against the grain. I got some knockoff, what the heck? Okay, um, I got some knockoff Birkenstocks. Um, these were buy one get 150% off. I don't know if anyone like wanted to know that. So there you go. They were buy one get one. 50% off. And let me just say, um, go buy these. They are the most comfortable shoe I have ever worn in my entire life. It's so comfortable and you can just wear them with anything and I'm I'm really passionate about the Birkenstocks. Well, the knockoff Birkenstocks. Um, then I picked up some panties that I'm not gonna show. Okay, um, I'm gonna show what I got from Forever 21. I got a lot of tops from Forever 21 since I got so many jeans at PacSun. I needed some tops to, you know, cover my upper body. Number one, I got this polka dot, orange polka dot. Wait, no, it's orange with blue polka dots. And what I like about it is it's got this like fake turtleneck thing. So like it actually doesn't go up your neck, but it like also it's higher than a typical shirt. It's like, it's cute. Okay, I also got this like sweatshirt jacket thing that I am literally Um, it's kind of cropped, but I tried it on with a pair of high-waisted jeans and it covered. I got this pink and white button-up shirt that is so cute with just like a pair of jeans. And it looks like you're trying, but like you're just throwing on a button-up, you know? I sound like Tan from Queer Eye. I finished Queer Eye yesterday and it was really sad because now I have no positivity in my life. And then I got a shirt. This is like a t-shirt and it's just like comfy. Another front shirt. Um, it's just like cropped yellow and it says the word Paris and I tried this on last time when I was there and I didn't get it because I was like yeah I tried it on again this time and I was like I really want it and then I got a pair of their plain black cotton leggings they're three dollars oh my gosh we're moving on to socks right now socks are my thing at school I am I don't know if other people notice it, but I like to think that I'm a sock person. I wear super cool socks, okay? Like if you need to describe your mood, wear socks that describe it. I love socks. So the Forever 21 I went to, I don't know, I used to get basically all of my socks from Forever 21, like last year and the year before and the year before that. And then this year I went to three different ones in the span of like the week that I was shopping. And none of them really had anything goofy, like at all. So I got um, four pairs of like not goofy socks. They're like cute. So these ones are yellow and they're just like crew. I still think they would be really cute with like jeans and a plain t-shirt. And I got these green and blue plaid ones. Some polka dots. These are a little bit more fun, but like, you know, they don't have like food or animals or like weird stuff on them. And then I got a bando. Wait, not a bando? What the heck? What are these called? Bandos. No, that's a bra. Wait, what are, what is this pattern called? Bandana. It's like bandana pattern. And they're black. So we went to Target. And it was a lot more successful. So I'm gonna show you all my socks for Target. All right, we got some zebras up in here. Flamingos. Ew, I just said the word oof. Tigers! I picked these up and I was like, Ryan of the Tiger! Oh, I love these. They match a jacket that I got from Target, which I'm just gonna show, cause it's sitting right here. I got this crop jean jacket, like it's made out of denim. Ah, it's so cute! Look at it, oh my God. And I also picked up an eight pack of gum. Then we've got some ladybugs. And then, the, these are a fan favorite, okay? 
I got some space socks. We have three more bags. I went to Marshalls because Marshalls and TJ Maxx are the hot diggity dog. And they've got all the brands, all the cute trends for good prices. Please sponsor me. I shop at your store a lot. This first shirt I got is just like a button up with like different widths of stripe and color. Um, but I got this one that says the Rolling Stones, but rather than like the typical Rolling Stones t-shirt, which is like the black with the American writing, this is like pencil writing, which I think looks way cooler. This t-shirt as well, which was $7. It's um, a Beatles shirt that says all you need is love. And it's like super groovy and cute. And I like it a lot. I got this shirt, which I actually, Whenever I saw it on the hanger, the hanger was broken, so you couldn't really see the shirt. And I was like, that is not cute. Like, I, I kind of picked it up to make fun of it, almost. But then I picked it up, and I was like, okay, wait, that's really cute. It's like a button. Like a, you know, like a comfy, I, I don't know. Next, I got these overalls that were on sale for $10. I like them because they aren't denim. They're actually corduroy. And so... They're a little different, and I think they're the right length to where I can still wear them to school. They're the short kind, not like jeans. They're just shorts, but I think they're long enough to wear to school. Um, I got one more t-shirt. I think this is the last t-shirt I got, and it just says Los Angeles, CA, California, whatever, and it's a size large. It's really big. But I thought it was cute on to throw on with leggings or like um, like boyfriend jeans, like doggy jeans or something. I bought this red flannel. This red flannel that is a size large. I no, it's a size medium. And I'm gonna stop talking in a British accent now. But it's a red flannel and it's got like the gray hood sort of thing with the strings. And it's like oversized, cute. Okay, I got a, um, it's like an olive green shirt. And I've said this before, since I have green eyes, green looks flattering on me because of my eyes, so. And then I get these every single year of school. They're ginger chews. And um, I've always gotten the, um, mango flavor but I got orange this time they're just like little chewy ginger candies that I like to have in my backpack because I just pop them in my mouth when I'm feeling tired and they're kind of spicy because of the ginger and so it wakes you up okay last bag of clothes I got this tie-dye shirt that was also really cheap and good to throw on for a basic outfit we got some Gingham pants? Gingham? Gingham? I have been looking for a pair of pants like this that are more fitting. If you saw my last haul, I got something a lot like them, but they're more like baggy. And I love them so much, they fit really well. This plain white t-shirt, it was $6 and just really comfy. It's a diff It's not just like plain looking cotton. It has like a ribbed material. Then I got two shirts for tennis which don't really matter, so I'm not gonna show y'all. And last but not least, some makeup wipes, because they're a lot cheaper at TJ Maxx. Um, thanks for listening to my TED Talk. Um, that's all I got. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Yeah, have a fantastic day, and if you are starting school soon, or have already started, I hope you have a fantastic year. I'm really excited to go back to school because I miss my friends. Yeah. Um. Bye. <laughs> oh, subscribe to my channel. Like this video. Whatever you want to do. Do whatever you want, you know? If you're like, I don't know. Okay, bye. Peace out.